the waterfront at Port Jefferson, which is a small, reactive, and, and uh, rapidly uh, being gentrified town on, on the north shore of Long Island, um, the Harbourfront Park uh, had uh, it was not a park. It had been an industrial site. I'm pretty sure there had been buildings on it at one time, which probably had been demolished. But it remained a sort of wasteland, and there was one building left, an old warehouse loft-like building, and the village took it over and asked us to develop a master plan which included the buildings that remained on the site as well as the park. We proposed a park that really celebrated the waterfront. It's a great site, it has views out to the north to Long Island Sound. We proposed shaping the landscape somewhat with the reintroduction of fill so it wouldn't just be a dead flat space but essentially being a green space and, and we were very concerned that it would not be taken over by um, active recreation um, because we wanted to make it accessible to people at all times and not suddenly, oh, you can't go into the park because there's a, there's a major uh, soccer game going on or whatever it might be. There are active recreation, it's played down, it's modest in contrast to the passive recreational aspects. We created a path that ran along the waterfront. There is a little beach, but it's not really accessible and not reusable. It was really more a matter of making paths that ran along the, the top of the embankment at the shoreline so that you could circulate through the park. There was a pier which allowed boaters to moor their boats. The last remaining industrial structure, the old chandlery build, uh, we turned into a community center and it's been very successful. It's used for all sorts of activities. They have dances there, they have concerts. And it really has made a big difference, I think, to the town of Port Jefferson. It's really given that, that town a, a reason for being there, which is the waterfront, you know, which, is, which they had ignored for many, many years.